It's week, oh man, week three? Week, week two. Week, oh, I don't forgot. So, it is week two and I am, let's see, I'm still enjoying this whole process. Um, I guess I feel like my camera, like I can't even focus right now because I feel like I am so bright. It's like, why camera? Why are you making me the brightest thing in the world right now? Give me some shadow. So, remember I told you guys that uh, loading this time was crazy and I gained 10 or over 10 pounds. Um, wasn't real weight gain, but still the scale was depressing me. Um, but I got back down to 229, which is really exciting by the end of week one. And then this week happened and I am down to 224. So uh, it's really, really exciting because I am just, I am so, so close to the two teens and it feels amazing. I haven't been there in so long and I'm just really, really excited. You know, it's, it's giving me that motivation to stay the course and keep fighting for my um, mental freedom from coping with food and things like that. Uh, so yeah, it's really, really awesome. Um, what else? So Tom is coming and it's really messing with me, but I'm not gonna let it, you know, mess up my focus. Because um, now that I'm not having fruit this round, and this is the first period coming up, I realized that uh, my cravings are kind of insane. The only thing I can think of is just, you know, the lack of the fruit, cause it was kind of like, that was like a tidbit of sugar, natural sugar, but still sugar. And um, yeah, like the last couple of days, I've just been like <sighs> craving carbs and sugar. And so that's been a little bit tough, but again, I'm not gonna let that deter me. I am going to stay focused and get it done. So hopefully that ends soon and I can go back to my normal. I also, uh, just want to let you guys know that like if you're experiencing more pimples um, while you're on HCG I feel like that's kind of normal too and it probably doesn't happen to everybody but I found that like um, mostly my arms like I get a lot of arm pimples they're not like big or anything but just like body acne on my arms and uh, I feel like my forehead is always breaking out but my forehead too uh, but it's okay um, uh, uh, it's not a big deal. It's well worth the process, so whatever. And I am guilty of not drinking my water. I will admit that. I don't know why, because the first round I did so good with that. Like I was happy to drink two ginormous bottles of water. And this round I've been slacking. I've been slacking hard. That is very true. So I am trying to make sure I drink my first bottle of water within the first like three hours of my work day and then making sure I spend the rest of the day drinking the second bottle for a total of a hundred and I want to say 128 ounces altogether for me, which is a little bit more than I need in a day. But I'm also just, you know, get some extra water in there, flush it out, uh, you know, you know? You know, okay, so you know, right, I know. And let's see, last time I was taking um, photos every week and I was also weighing in every week and my schedule has just been so crazy that, you know, I just, my main focus is to get the video to you guys consistently every week. Um, and I mean, you guys see me in the video, you see what I look like for the most part, like, it's clear that I'm thinning. What I may do is take some, what do I have? Um, I have photos from the very first round, like that first day, and then I also took photos beginning this round. So maybe at the end of the video for you guys, I'll just show you like side by side what I look like starting both rounds. And then I'll try to um, 
take photos every week to kind of show you guys the progression but um probably not gonna do the weigh-ins just because like it was such a struggle last time my, my scale is so reflective and <laughs> let me tell y'all okay it was hard trying to weigh myself in the best shape possible which is early in the morning after the first time you use the bathroom and uh you know wearing what you were born into this world in i don't know how y'all were born but i definitely wasn't born wearing clothes so yeah i kept catching the reflection and that's just not something i'm willing to put on the internet you know i'm not trying to have all my goods out there so not doing that but what i will try to do is maybe for the um final final video i will try 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 to get that way in done figure out the camera angles so that y'all don't see nothing else but the number on the scale let me see is that all in case you're wondering my lips are still dry yep i feel like LL Cool J. um because they just i wear chapstick all day i wear fancy chapstick cheap chapstick you know i've tried a lot of them uh and i think it's just a symptom of that low carb lifestyle uh the dry i feel like i say that every video but i also am fully aware of every time i do this mm-hmm yep and it gives me like 30 seconds of relief and i cut that out of the videos so y'all don't see that um but sometimes I, I can't cut it out and I, and I realize it's, it's excessive. It's excessive. Yeah. All right, sorry, getting off track. I apologize for my ashy lips and I apologize for being a little all over the place. Or maybe not, maybe I don't. I feel like my method of recording is equal to my background. It's a lot, it's a lot. I'm a lot. All right. Um. Good luck to everybody else on their weight loss journeys. Like I say, every single week, I hope you are doing so good. I am going to watch your videos uh, and I will try to comment as much as I can and show that support. You know, I appreciate everybody who watches my videos. Uh, uh, uh. And yeah, I just, I hope y'all have the best week ever. And um, here's to next week, week three. I cannot wait. I might be in the two T's. That will be epic. All right, okay. Um, but regardless, whatever I lose will be amazing. And don't give up and don't eat that donut. And if you do eat that donut, um, forgive yourself and go eat a piece of celery. Okay, bye.